Hi everyone! Welcome to Cloud Dolls! This video is gonna be a short one because I have a big project. Don't forget to subscribe, like and share it if you don't wanna lose it. In this video I'm gonna let you see how I do the stand for my doll. First I need a silicone mold. You can find them in all kind of shops. I'm gonna use this metal stock in gold color because it match with my doll and of course UV resin and my UV lamp cure everything I'm gonna use some blue pigment for resin it's amazing but you can use whatever you want it and I'm also use gold leaf a gold wire three millimeters Let's start it. First of all, I'm gonna put two or three drops to hold the stock in the middle of the, the mold. And I'm gonna use the parts that I cut it, the ugly part, and I'm gonna put it upside down so you don't see it. And I'm gonna hold it really good so that he doesn't go to the left or to the right so that he stay right in place I let it cool for 90 seconds and now I'm gonna fill it the mold with the UV resin With the stock, I just pull it around. I fill all the empty spaces. I try to get rid of all the bubbles. And now I mix a little bit of blue pigment with my UV resin and I throw it in the mold the way I want it. You can use different colors, different materials, brilliants, glitters, nail art, flowers, whatever you want it. It's really simple and it's really cool to do it. I really like it. Now with my stock I'm pulling the pigment to the center of the mold to give it more shape and more interest. And now is gold time. I put a pieces of gold leaf in the middle and also with the stock I make them small, go around and then put them wherever I want it. And now with my lighter, I get rid of all of the hair bubbles before I cure it. This support is going to be part of my doll for next week. She's amazing. She gave me a lot of work. But I'm really, really, really proud of her. I cannot wait to let you see her. And after it's cured, 
it's time to get out of the mold and he looks so great. Now I have to sand it around it to make it even with my Dremel. Don't forget to use a mask when you're sanding because of the small dusty so that you don't breathe it. After sanding, I'm gonna clean it with a little bit of water and a cotton just to get rid of all of the dusty with water. It's really simple to do, gives me a lot of pleasure and brings your doll to another level. Now with the resin, I'm gonna glue it gold leaves around it and of course I have to cure it with the UV lamp. Now we're gonna use the wired to support the door. In this case, I'm gonna support her between the legs because it's not possible to do it around the waist, but you can do it around the waist or whatever you want it. If you do it under, you just have to be careful because the back side is always bigger than the front side. So when you put it in, in the stalk, you have to, to get attention to that little detail. I'm going to use also the resin to glue it and put it in place. Now it's time to clean it and for that I'm going to use a soft brush. We are almost ready. If you want to know the kind of material that I use, you can always check the description box below. In my link tree is also all my social media links that you can find it there. To protect the stand, I'm gonna use my acryl glossy varnish and let it dry. And the 
the stand is ready. I hope you enjoyed the small video. I hope I give you a lot of inspiration to make your own stand doll. You have a lot of possibilities. An open world. Don't forget to subscribe, like it, comment and share it. Don't forget to see the video of next week. I'm really, really, really excited. So, I leave you with this one. Bye! See you in my next video! Thank you.